This is the 1931 Bentley 8 liter. Cooling the colossal inline-six engine is no mean feat. Hidden behind the classic Bentley grille lays a radiator twice the size of one found in the average modern car. The 8-litre inline-six engine generates 220 horsepower this allows the car to cruise comfortably at 80 miles per hour and achieve top speeds of over 100 miles per hour. The rear-wheel drive Bentley 8-litre features a four-speed manual transmission. Simplicity isn't this car's strong suit. With a variety of throttle, ignition and mixture controls to master, the 8-litre takes considerably more effort to drive than modern cars. Centuries of experience from the renowned Mullina coach builders went into building the 8 litres body. In many ways, its design has more in common with a horse-drawn carriage than a modern car. Of the 108 litres ever made, each is completely unique, making the car highly sought after by collectors. This particular model is based on one in Jay Leno's collection. In the 1930s, it cost just $5 to fill this Bentley's 25-gallon fuel tank. But with the car costing more than the average house at the time, it was far from affordable. The Bentley 8 litre is equipped with 21 inch aluminum covered wire wheels and drum brakes.
The 1930 Bentley 8-litre could have become one of the world's greatest cars, like the gargantuan Bugatti Royale. But it was launched in London in 1930 with a price of £1,850. Back then, that was a lot. Especially since at almost exactly the same time, the Great Depression arrived in Europe. As a result, only 100 8 litres were ever made, and the car's failure brought Bentley to its knees. Within a year, it was sold to Rolls-Royce. Of those 100, only 78 are left, and every one is unique. This was a time when companies like Bentley sold you the bottom half of a car, the chassis, engine and wheels, and then left you to find a coach builder for the body and the seats and the roof. So this car shares its huge 220 horsepower, six cylinder engine and 21 inch wheels with all the other eight liters. But the rest, that was always a one off. On this one, for example, the roof opens down the middle. So when it rains, those on the left could opt to get wet while those on the right could stay dry. Strangely, it was an idea that didn't catch on, just like the rest of the Bentley 8 litres. Centuries of experience. 